Austin. I'm Jody Miller. Let's get started. Jay Carney is stepping down as White House press secretary, but his job of putting a positive spin on all President Obama's failures will continue to be done by most of mainstream media. <laughs> President Obama gave Jay Carney a bro hug to say goodbye to him and to thank Carney for all his wonderful, heartfelt lies. <laughs> Following the resignation of VA Chief Eric Shinseki, Chris Matthews asked if President Obama will continue to diddle on the VA scandal. Uh, no, Chris, Obama will just ignore it. Diddling is more Bill Clinton's thing. <laughs> President Obama's plan to allow illegal immigrants to join the military is moving forward. In fact, military recruiters will soon be setting up offices in Home Depot parking lots. <laughs> NBC's Richard Engel said U.S. relations have not improved with any country during the Obama presidency. Engel then was pulled into a van and hasn't been seen or heard from since. <laughs> Several Tea Party candidates have won primary races in Texas and are expected to win in November. Or, as the mainstream media reported it, the Tea Party is dead. <laughs> the White House accidentally outed the CIA chief in Afghanistan. Fortunately, the White House record for telling the truth is so bad, nobody actually believed them. <laughs> And finally, some good news for Donald Sterling. Not only might he get $1.8 billion for the Clippers, he's also getting his own reality TV show this fall. It'll be called The Amazing Racist. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Buzz, and everybody, I'm Jody Miller. Be sure to subscribe to our videos on YouTube, and we'll catch you next time.